Today's reading is from Psalm 104, verses 10 to 28. He makes springs pour water into the ravines. It flows between the mountains. They give water to all the beasts of the field. The wild donkeys quench their thirst. The birds of the sky nest by the waters. They sing amongst the branches. He waters the mountains from his upper chambers. The land is satisfied by the fruit of his work. He makes grass grow for the cattle and plants for people to cultivate, bringing forth food from the earth, wine that gladdens human hearts and oil to make their faces shine, bread that sustains their hearts. The trees of the Lord are well watered, the cedars of Lebanon that he planted. There the birds make their nests. The stork has its home in the junipers. The high mountains belong to the wild goats and the crags are a refuge for the hyrax. He made the moon to mark the seasons and the sun knows when to go down. You bring darkness and it becomes night. All the beasts of the forest prowl. The lions roar for their prey and they seek their food from God. The sun rises and they steal away. They return and lie down in their dens. Then people go out to work, to their labour, until evening. How many are your works, Lord? In wisdom you made them all. The earth is full of your creatures. There is the sea, vast and spacious, teeming with creatures beyond number, living things both large and small. There the ships go to and fro, and Leviathan, which you formed to frolic there. All creatures look to you, Lord, to give them their food at the proper time, and when you give it to them, they gather it up. When you open your hand, they are satisfied with good things.